Hey, I'm Roland with Mobile Geeks, and what we have right here is the new Lenovo X1 Carbon. It's part of the ThinkPad range, and it's actually an updated version of the X1 Carbon Ultrabook that Lenovo put out last year. Um, this one is kind of getting interesting. At first, it looks the same as last year's model, but this one has a couple of new features that are really nice, actually. Um, we're talking about a 14-inch Ultrabook in this case. It's the lightest Ultrabook in the 14-inch range on the planet. It's uh, using carbon fiber as a case material, so that's why it's so light. It comes in at 1.28 kilograms, which is 2.9 pounds. That's what I thought. I'm German, so excuse my uh, measurements or metrics. Um, we have on the right side a combined uh, power USB 3 and Ethernet port using a proprietary plug, proprietary plug from Lenovo because it's using a docking station that's called the OneLink Pro in this case. And when we make it in a second, I'm gonna show you the dock too. Let's move on to the HDMI. That's a full-size HDMI port right there. We have a display port going on right next to that and a full-size USB 3 port, plus another, uh, that one right there that's totally unsharp on this video is actually the headset jack. Up on the top on the front, we have the uh, integrated mouse buttons on the trackpad that's fully clickable plus the standard Lenovo ThinkPad track point in the middle right there and on the right we move on to a fingerprint reader up there and on the sides you get another USB 3 port a that's the proprietary um, Ethernet port in the middle right there and the fan vents plus a canceling lock back there um, let's quickly check out the docking station so you get this special plug from Lenovo right here. Let's try and focus. They've combined, as I said, Ethernet power and USB 3 into this one plug and you hook it up to this box which actually holds two USB ports on the front and two more USB 3 ports in the back plus two USB 2.0, an Ethernet port and a display port I think plus a power plug for powering the whole combination of the two devices plus a full-size DVI monitor plug. Um, let's move back to the X1 Carbon itself. Uh, it has a 14-inch screen running at a WQHD resolution of 2560 by 1440 pixels. There's also going to be models without touch and with lower resolution. So you're actually talking about a 1600 by 900 non-touch screen on the uh, lower end ones. And what you get up here is a webcam. Under the hood, you actually have Intel Core i5 and Core i7 Haswell CPUs in this one. There's actually a Core i5-4200U and up to eight gigs of RAM, 16, eight, just eight gigs of RAM, plus SSDs up to 512 gigs. There's one really cool feature on the new uh, ThinkPad X1 Carbon that is this strip up here. It, that's actually a fully touch sensitive LCD kind of e-ink display so it doesn't use power. And what you do with it is actually you replace the standard func functions, function keys. So you get rid of the function button on the keyboard and move that up here on top. And when you press that button, you get, after five seconds, you get the standard function keys. So you can quickly change between uh, different uh, functions of the device. Plus, you also have a menu to actually change the function keys as you like. And when you switch apps, I'm just going to swipe up here, switching between Skype, for example, plus a couple of other apps. You actually see back here that this display strip actually changes as well. So you can always use special functions for Skype and the browser and a couple of other apps on the X1 Carbon. I was Roland with Mobile Geeks at CES Unveiled. Thank you. Bye.